job. Wow, someone with parenting skills. Oh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. No one's gonna eat that shit. No, 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 you didn't. No, you didn't. See, look, even the duck knows it's terrible. Look at it, it's all burned around the edges. That's disgusting. Alright, now can we get some actual military talk going on? Like, seriously, I'm tired of this cooking lessons. Alright, how do I take control of the little robot? There's my the iMac here. Like, can we break it? Yeah, can we break this stupid thing? iMacs are a complete waste of money, seriously. The keys to the system are Big Boss's genetic code and biometric data. Without them, there's no way to gain access. Anything actually worth Wait, collecting? What's Liquid been doing all this time? Oh, look, it's Raiden. So we can whip him in his sleep. He's been performing tests. Two tests. The first, using the genetic code of Liquid's DNA chip. Yes. In his second attempt, <laughs> yes. Weep her. With Snake on his old ass, or Otacon on his ass. Yes, weep. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? Can't go up. Oh, yes, you can. Whoa. You can turbo up those stairs. Neither your genetic pattern nor liquid genetic pattern is a 100% match for Big Boss. Ty made him start coughing. <laughs> oh, I'm a terrible person. What's this? A compress? Well, you see, all that smoking you've been doing, it's altered your genetic code. You're also starting to gain cancer. Look, he shitted out some music. They'll tell me what it is later, I guess. All right, I guess that's it. Three items. I want to watch the cutscene. Wait, what am I saying? I want to watch cutscene. Of course I'm going to watch cutscene. They're going to hose it down my freaking throat. All right, so back down these stairs. I spent an hour of this game crouch walking. Both you and Liquid are similar to Big Boss as you could possibly be, but you're still different. Different? All right, anything back here? If there isn't, then I'm done. Oh wow, there is. Look, ammo. Here's their helicopter. Oh look, a little teddy bear. Ah, oh, black and white teddy bear together. I don't know what the symbolism is for this. Snake and Raiden, maybe? But Solidus is dead. That they could actually be, you know, partners. Listen carefully, Snake. This is the most important part. Alright, here we go. I'm done. Alright, let's watch the mission briefing. The AI that controls the system employs a highly aggressive, advanced IDS. It uses a special code to inspect all data and commands circulating within the network. Any data that fails to conform to that code is treated as a foreign object and expunged, like viruses killed by white blood cells. The authentication program this IDS uses is based on a genetic identification program, one I helped develop for Fox. So you really are the root of all evil, Naomi. So that host commands only execute properly if the key matches perfectly. The root of all problems is from this very attractive woman. However, Doesn't even look the same as she did in Metal Gear Solid 1. If the IDS suspects someone is trying to break into the system, it registers that genetic code on a blacklist. That code is then blocked and can never again be used to access the system. So, if you're going to use a substitute, you need to find a new genetic access code with each new trial. So when Liquid access the system in the Middle it was East, using South different, America, yeah, it was only a test. Different DNA. Snake and Big Boss don't have the same genetic code. Strictly speaking, Snake and Liquid aren't the same either. Which is why Fox Die only affected Liquid at Shadow Moses, and spared you. Let's put it this way. If Liquid uses Big Boss's genetic code, we're all we screwed. Do, we'll have the system completely under his control. Oh, 
Hold on. I thought having his code wasn't enough. You need his biometric data at the same time, don't you? That's right. And Big Boss is already dead. No. He's alive. Oh, sweet. Big Boss. Alive? Alive. His body is. Or rather, his cells. That's impossible. Big Boss survives as a biomort. A brain dead shell. Oh, that's good. For such a major character. What a nice way to go. This is bullshit. <laughs> he just sits down. Liquid has already left for Europe in search of Big Boss's body. Right from the start, he knew his experiment in South America wasn't going to work. Europe, huh? Oh shit. The test was a fail. <laughs> even with his code. As I feared, it's not pure enough. We need all of him. Our only remaining option is to secure the original. If Liquid obtains the body, he'll be primed to make his final move. Uh, allowing him total control of the system. Yep. Exactly. Unless we can stop him first. Right in. Hurt really badly, man. And there's nothing we can do for him. No, he's leaking blood out of his cuts. Cyborg blood. Wow, she got in there. Can't believe this sort of thing still goes on. The war economy is heating up the R and D race. <laughs> Good job, Sonny. It's not just the PMCs either. Every corporation tethered to the military industrial complex is losing its sense of morality. Damn, is that supposed to be a beard on his face? It looks like freaking bumps on his skin. Like little worms crawled under his skin. What the hell? Can we make Jack better? I don't know. What you looking at me for? I'm smoking. I'll make him worse. <laughs> I will fuck right in up. Sonny. Damn, look at that. And by that I mean, you know, the typing, not the titties. It's no use. There's nothing we can do here. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Look at this. His artificial blood needs dialysis. Are you kidding me? Dialysis? Getting his so who's gonna help us? We have nothing on this aircraft. Not gonna last that long. Dialysis? Is that like what k kidneys do? That's right. Raiden's blood is an older type of artificial blood that was used by the military. Called... White Called pigeon poop. After it's been in use for a while, the blood needs to be dialyzed, filtered, to keep the impurities out. Right now, he's slipping into autotoxemia. Wait, would this have happened anyway, regardless of whether or not he'd been stabbed? It sounds like it. Oh, look, the zone of the Ender's background. <laughs> That's such a cool Easter egg.
What do you mean? Eastern Europe. They have equipment that can heal me there. Where? The same place Liquid went? <laughs> Dr. Magnar. He saved my life. <laughs> and there he goes again. Why would you even try to sit him up if he's, you know, if he's barely conscious? Dr. Madnar. I've heard of him. A world-renowned cybernetics expert. Strictly underground, though. We're in luck, then. It's settled. We must head for No Europe. shit. The sooner we get there, the oh, better. Whoa, what are you doing leading me around by hand? I'll call Campbell and have him get us landing clearance. That's awkward. Don't touch me. I don't know what you are. You're not a man. You're a very skinny man with weird bumps on his oh, chest. Snake, where are you going? Uh, I'm gonna be spewing up poison soon enough anyway. What's one more smoke gonna hurt? Uh -uh. No smoking on aircraft. Oh look, they put up a sign for him. Oh, you're kidding me. No! <laughs> That's not cool. They lowered my psych for nothing. God damn it, I'm not giving myself cancer fast enough. Oh, yes. Yep, killed in action. Olga Grozig. Guglovich? Galigovich? That's his sister. And then there's that Zone of the Enders thing. So is this what you nerds do all day and night? Just staring at computer screens? <laughs> uh, yes, it is what we do all day and night. No one's watching. Raiden's dying. Snake is trying to smoke, and Sunny's asleep. She's making her move. Oh, what's she doing? Making sure she's asleep. It's time to seduce the nerd. Huh. Who is Why are you looking at porn? <laughs> yep. Ooh, 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 ooh. Really? I never knew you had a sister. For a moment, I thought she might have been your girlfriend. No, I, I don't have a... Emma was a brilliant programmer. She wrote the worm that destroyed the Arsenal Gear AI. Then... Vamp. Then Vamp stabbed her, and then he stabbed her with her knife. I'm so sorry. No, there's nothing for you to be sorry for. Or me. Two pointy objects. An anime otaku. Oh. One of them's a knife, so the other one's the other I'm thing, if you know what I mean. I was always fascinated by sci-fi anime. That's what got me into this line of work. It's too bad reality wasn't so simple. I never even what the hell? That does not look like hair. That my own research would cause so much misery. I mean, it's not like a science holics or Satanist or anything. But even when we've got the best of intentions, we end up being used by others for evil. Dr. Emmerich, I... Uh, you see this? Sonny helped 